morning, everybody. It's Mark here with the Bosco Fest. I wanted to send out a Valentine's video today, and uh, I figured I would start with strawberries since somebody, we have a secret admirer here that sent us a dozen chocolate covered strawberries, and we don't know who it is. So if it's you, speak up. Anyway, these are a, a collection of, a further collection of our fruit crate and grape and uh, various food labels original labels, um, and I just found them. Some of them are, some of them have prices on them that I purchased 30 years ago, but they're not the prices now, but I just think some of the graphics on these are so fun and the weird names people came up with for fruit. So, and then this one's cool because it's got like a gold on it. You know, and these are a varying age. Here's one where they would, the packer would imprint the name of the, the company on, on the label itself later. Here's the I don't know what a special cushion bottom rose is, but you know, if you got some today, unfortunately this one has a little damage on the corner. Every once in a while you'll find, you know, you find these and they, they got damaged or I'll buy them for many years ago. These are, I probably bought these before I moved to California 32 years ago. Anyway, I just thought I would show them because the graphics are so bold. Anybody named Deb out there? Wish I had one that said Karen. And uh, here's a camel, Placer County, Air King. This one's got awesome graphics. So these things have amazing graphics. Those are for Zinfandel grapes, by the way. There's another Nino. I think that's the one I started with. Here's a bocce ball. This guy's out on the orchard playing bocce with the Zinfandel grapes. The Corinthian's really cool. I love that sailboat. And then, oops, this one's upside down. But it's an amazing eagle, beautiful eagle. You got your silver maple. Your Lady Rowena, I don't know who Lady Rowena was, but she apparently had something to do with California fruits. <laughs> There's drum dairy, grapes. Here's a tomato label, it's really fun. Cow ripe, Mont Elisa, these are grapes, non-irrigated grapes. These are for Petite Syrah. Um, here are Florita brand. I don't even know what it is. Florida brand something. Bright Bloom. And then there's, I'm getting into some older ones here. Exeter Lily, that's another Florida. Here, let's see, go down here a few. Go down to this one. I have a few of these. This one's a Summit, it's, I love, love that image. Got a little damage on the corner that could be framed out. But these defy the world or so. These are much earlier. And these are from Quinton Salem in New Jersey, and they're tomato. That's a was a tomato packer. I have four or five of these actually. I can't remember. I found these I think in a barn in southern Missouri. Anyway, here's New York State grapes. Sweet baby. Here's your Climax brand succotash. And your golden grain sugar corn. And your Mission brand Sunkiss tabletop grapes. Your baby turtle. Love the turtle. White baby would be on a giant turtle. I don't know. I think these guys would get drunk and just sit around and come up with names for these brands. So a couple more New York States. This one's cool. It's Tokay, Flame Tokay grapes. Also, if you've ever had a Tokay wine, oh my God. It's the best. Those are usually uh, what, Hungarian wines, I think. That's gorgeous. This is actually, I don't know if you can see it. Stone lithography. A lot of these are stone lithography. There's a sugar corn. This one's really cool. You have various ones. So what they would do here is this would be the brand and then this would be what they were doing. So I have tomatoes, I have, uh, I have tomatoes, I think I have corn, I have peas. I think I have about six different ones of these. This one's cool because it's all gold stamp. So you can see it, gold doesn't have in the envelope there. This squaw brand this is very early and it also has gold on it. You can kind of tell. Sorry, with these, these sleeves make it hard for me to show some of this on video. Anyway, I just thought I would show that. There's another 40 just in that little envelope. And I found these three weeks ago in the basement. Anyway, have a great Sunday. Happy Valentine's Day. I hope you get the succotash grapes, chocolate, strawberries, or whatever it is that you wanted today.